What's up, conspirators? How are things on your end of the video? On my end of the video, the video I got for you is a video that's non-existent because it's, well, Sunday, except for this video. So, <sighs> time to recap today's daily events. Fixed eyebrows first, you know, you gotta, you gotta have good looking eyebrows, that's all I'm gonna say. You don't need hair or a wig, something that looks like Trump, eyebrows do just fine. <laughs> Anyways, so I seem to have this problem now of recording late videos because I think, oh yeah, you know, I could do it, you know, sometime during the day when something interesting is going on. Problem is nothing interesting goes on that day, and then it's the end of the day, and then I'm like, uh oh, I forgot to record a video. So hence today's video being recorded late once again. So as for today's daily events, nothing really different went on today except except the Taco Bell story. So, before we get to that, uh, to start out from, you know, the morning up until the afternoon, now the evening. So, in the morning, obviously you went to church. Um, when you came back, um, some of the family went off to uh, a party. Some of us stayed home. And for those of us who stayed home, we kind of just, you know, sat around and chilled for a couple hours, and then we got chilly. No, <laughs> so then, you know, we had to warm up. And so we decided to go to Taco Smell. Now, that's our affectionate name that we call Taco Bell. Uh, Booger Fling is Burger King, and Mickey D's is, you know, McDonald's. So we have all random nicknames for, like, every fast food restaurant you'd ever want to know. If you're interested, you know, leave a comment. So we go to Taco Smell for some, you know, tacos, mainly to Dorito Loco tacos, because those are good stuff. So we go there. I make my order in a drive-thru. I, uh, and then you know, I'm waiting to pick up my order at the window, and I hand them, you know, the cash to pay for the food. Well, uh, the lady took the cash, and then she went running off to find change, and this other guy comes in, and he has the receipt and the bag of food. So he gives me the bag of food, and I'm like, okay, cool, I got all my food now, because now I can leave. Thinking in the back of my mind that I paid with a credit card, debit card. So I count the food, make sure everything's there, because this particular... Taco Bell has left uh, without, you know, certain items on occasion. They'll, like, we order, like, five things, and they give us four, and we're like, where's the fifth one? I don't know, and then we have to go back. So I wanted to make sure we had to order right. And so I check, and I'm like, okay, we're good. And I leave. Well, I just pull out of the driveway, and I'm like, oh, no. I paid with cash, didn't I? Where's the change? My sister's gonna kill me because she gave me cash to buy food. So... <laughs> I drive back, right? I drive back, and now they're like, Hey, look, it's the 403 guy! Because apparently that was what the change was. So, I get the change back. They're like, Oh yeah, we thought you'd left. I was like, No, -uh, I'm, not, I'm not leaving. I'm going to make sure, you know, your guys' um, drawer balances, and I get my money. And they're like, Yeah, well, we're kind of like swapping out people right now. And so they give me my change, and I go back to the car, and I'm like, Oh, wait. Count the change. The change was 404. One penny extra. And I'm like, <sighs> so I go walk back in and I put a penny on the counter and I say, you guys gave me one too many pennies. And then I leave. <sighs> I gotta say, what really irked me as a teller for years, even afterwards to now, um, was when I was a teller at Wells Fargo Bank, is when my drawer was off by one dang penny and I didn't catch it because I was really you know picky about making sure my drawer balanced so I know how it goes when you're a cashier and drawers and balancing cash and all that so it was kind of a funny story for me today so that's what I did today what'd you guys do oh and I, I watched a mentalist and uh apprentice so that being said what'd you guys do be sure to leave a post down below in the comment section I don't leave a reply to it otherwise that's about it I gotta go be sure to share this video with a friend conspirator pretty much Keep being awesome until we meet again. Rope five out.